Hello there. Now, there are snow warnings in force today across the eastern side of the country. Bitterly cold wherever you are, but there will be some sunshine on offer as well. But a rash of showers coming in from the North Sea. So a real wintry feel with a strong wind as well. So feeling cold in that breeze. In between, we will see some dry weather and the nature of showers. There will be some dry interludes around. Not everyone's seeing those snow showers, but particularly we will see them along the eastern side of the country. Look at this temperature struggling to get above freezing across some parts of the country. So through Monday into Tuesday, we continue to see a blast of very cold air coming in from Siberia, a huge ridge of high pressure. And it's this cold front here which will slowly move in through the early hours of Tuesday morning, bringing some more significant snow to Scotland as well as northern England. So through Monday into Tuesday, those snow showers are relentless in the east. Further west, we continue to see some clearer skies. And then this feature here, bringing with it some stronger winds and also that snow through the early hours of Tuesday morning, causing problems on the roads as well as the rails. Temperatures then dipping down to around minus three, minus four degrees Celsius, so a widespread frost. First thing tomorrow morning, we pick up on the snow across the more northern parts of England. Further south, those snow showers will align and there is a warning out for this. Actually, it's an amber warning, which means be prepared for some really tricky weather outside, some nasty conditions further north as well. Again, an amber warning in force across the eastern side of England. Up to 10 centimetres snow, particularly over the hills with some drifting possible. So through the day, everywhere we'll see those showers, particularly across Scotland, England, as well as some parts of Wales, pushing in on that cold wind. Perhaps some showers just creeping in across the western side of the country as well. But wherever you are, it's going to feel bitterly cold in between those snow showers, perhaps some drier weather, but you can see they're fairly frequent, again, coming in from the east. Temperatures struggling one, two or three degrees Celsius. Those snow showers continue through Tuesday into Wednesday. In fact, the Met Office has issued an amber warning for snow across the eastern side of Scotland through Wednesday. So we continue to see some very wintry conditions through the middle part of the week. And temperatures, again, sub-zero wherever you are through the early hours of Wednesday morning. So through Wednesday, snow warnings continue to be in force. There will be some travel disruption and feeling bitterly cold.